So that's an example of the clock again, sort of adding to the 808 and that whole sort of hi-hat environment going on here. I think they're so wicked together, um, particularly in this part here. <laughs> So I really play them like drums or like percussion. Um, if you listen to this um, part here, standalone. And you can use them more mechanically that way as well. It doesn't always have to be the super organic thing. I think sometimes with more modern music pop, you almost want them to be sort of repetitive, which is one of the reasons that they're laid out on the keyboard in this very specific way. So you have individual control over every single part of the ticks and talks. Here is another little mini demo as well, using the exact same I'll do it that we've been listening to. <laughs> <laughs> 